Hi there. In this video, I'm going to be looking at financial processes, uh, but more specifically, balance sheets as a form of monitoring and controlling. Um, so firstly, balance sheets, um, also called statements of financial position. Um, and it represents a business's assets and liabilities at a particular point in time. Um, and it represents the net worth, so the equity of the business as well. Okay, so assets represent what is owned by a business and liabilities are claims by people other than the owners against the assets um, and represent what is owed by the business. Um, and owner's equity represents the owner's financial interest in the business um, or the net worth of the business. Um, we've got what's called the accounting equation. Now it's called a balance sheet because it needs to balance. Um, so the accounting equation is assets has to equal liabilities plus owner's equity. So if there's $100,000 worth of assets, there needs to be combined between liabilities and owner's equity, $100,000 as well. It has to balance, uh, hence the name balance sheet. So let's look at a very simple balance sheet here. Um, I say it's simple because it's um, it doesn't really have much on there in terms of uh, assets, liabilities, etc. However, it's just to give an example here. So um, we've got the current assets and current liabilities. They're things that um, for assets uh, can be converted to cash within 12 months and for liabilities need to be paid back within 12 months. Um, so for example, we've got cash, inventories, accounts receivable, which is money uh, that is owed to them by other companies or other people. Um, and current liabilities, we've got accounts payable, money that is owed to other people. Uh, so then we've got um, non-current assets and non-current liabilities. Uh, these are items that, are in, in the sense of assets, that can be converted to cash um, in, a, in a time frame greater than 12 months, and liabilities, uh, non-current liabilities, are items that uh, need to be repaid in a time frame greater than 12 months. So for example, uh, intangibles, plant and equipment, um, and loans um, on the side of non-current liabilities. Now, as you can see through all those numbers, assets, the amount of numbers, uh, the amount of um, money on the assets side equals the, um, the figures on the liabilities plus owner's equity. It needs to balance. Again, hence the name balance sheet. Um, so I hope this brief video on um, uh, Balance sheets has been useful. Uh, the next video will be looking at financial ratios, uh, starting with liquidity. Thank you.